Ooh, interesting shot. Dude, I love introductions like that. So they have this camera shot. It looks like it's underneath the glass or it's in, in it. No, it's underneath. And then you can see it being poured in. And then the color correction and then the aperture for the camera, you can see it's really, really open because you, the blur in the background, dude, we have the most shallow depth of field ever. Oh my God. They must be using like a 1.2 aperture or something even like more open because that is in the color correction. It's very orangey, has this orange tint into it i really like it great sound design dude so with the b-roll i'm guessing we're gonna have some kind of cocktail party or some event happening because we already have like really fancy shots the color correction is emphasizing that it looks it's very cinematic it has that movie look as well and then we have food got the boca looks fancy and yeah they're all dressed up there's some kind of event they're going to which i wish i was invited to damn bro cream soda Ooh. not sure about that shot let me let me see that again first of all their dancing looks really good i've never seen exo this is my first exo video so i'm really excited to get into this band as well only thing i don't understand okay so they use a speed ramp and then they speed ramp into the drink i mean it does work it does work but in my personal opinion what i would have probably done is maybe spin around it more that is a shit ton of bokeh dude oh my god there are so many lights behind them that is nuts like look at behind me that's how many lights i have and that that must be wow nice shots also bro i turned the captions on why does youtube hate me so much yo man you got a drink on the piano what are you doing what that spells on the piano it gives me anxiety look here <laughs> Okay. Oh, nice shots right there. I like that. The camera work as well. Oh, that is a good with the gun on the background and just the color correction of the red. Mm, that's it. Okay. Cam or the camera work's going really well with the dancing. It looks so good together. I think I hear guitar in the back. I like how as soon as we hear the guitar come in, he's holding a guitar and it's kind of like the most simplistic thing. But then we have these complimentary colors. Dude, the color correction on all these K-pop videos lately have just been outstanding. Hey. hey. Nice vocals too. The high that what the And then that shot right there. Oh wait, we gotta talk about that. You guys you guys know that. And then the camera zooming out. It's like a Dutch angle as well. It's like rotating. I really like that. And then we follow that up with another shot rotating, falling down with a lot of motion blur. Ooh, nice turbulent effect right there. In this music video, I'm noticing we have a lot of close-up shots. And when you have an aperture really, really open, uh, a low number, and you have close-up shots, like, you're gonna get, like, everything in the back being blurred. Really nice look. Because you can see some parts of it are blurry, some are not. That turbulent effect is really cool. Oh, that's such a cool transition, actually. So we have the coin spinning, and then they use this uh, ripple effect. 
and then they follow it up with the next shot being already rippled and then they unripple it it's like some turbulent effect it could also be like a, a plug-in ripple effect but then it looks really cool because both of the objects are very circular so having it zoom out with two circular shots re corresponding together looks really fluent i like that i like that a lot oh my man just going in there <laughs> all right it's aggressive Oh, I like the, the jacket. Okay. Oh, man. All blinged up. Those shots always give me anxiety. I mean, I know you have to, um... Usually they'll put the camera in a bag or something, but... <laughs> They're just like, they're just like too good for us. They're just throwing a drink at us. God damn. I love that. There was like a little bit of a flutter cut right there. So a flutter cut is kind of like when it flickers back and forth. It could also be dark where it completely goes to dark. They do that in horror movies a lot. I like the uh, sets. Drink it all. Now we have a shot of a heart melting. I didn't really focus on what the the meaning of this music video is. So if anyone could leave a comment down below, let me know what it means. But I mean, that's a really powerful shot itself. Like a heart melting, bro. That's sad. I mean, like. Sing out, they got good vocals. You sing like that, you really need to use your lungs and, and that trans. I didn't even see that. So they have the they just have the clip of the guy and then the water spilling out they could have slowed that down it could be vfx as well the water droplet could be fake and you know how i think it could be fake if you look at the water droplet you could yeah right there i don't think it's real but then what they do is they zoom in yeah they zoom in into the water droplet which is really cool now the only thing i think they could have done differently is maybe they could have tracked the water droplet and then zoomed in on it because if you see it zooming in it's like jumping back and forth which they that could be a stylistic thing but at the same time and this is just my opinion this doesn't take away from the video at all i just like to be honest with you guys because it's you know it's important i feel like like this video is already a banger itself but if you see it like moving up and down sometimes with these kind of shots it's good to just like straight up zoom in it with no like jittery looks and then that transitions what the hell the card burning and then they have fire overlay and then they just mask that Oh, I like that ending shot. That's a really good shot. What the heck? Ooh. Nice, dude. That was awesome. That was great. I'm going to go drink some cream soda, honestly, right now. Like always, thanks for watching. I love all of you, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out.